Hey guys, what's going on? It's Matt again here with Daisy. Um, I just wanted to go into a little more detail and give you guys a little better idea of what we're doing with Daisy and the e-collar. Um, had a pretty good response with the little video I posted earlier uh, of starting her on the e-collar. So I just want to go over how we condition the e-collar. Um, this is uh, conditioning the e-collar to your dog, in my opinion, is hands down the most important part of the process. Because if we just slap a collar on our dog, send them off, start hitting numbers or hitting buttons, the dog's just going to be confused. So we really have to teach the dog what that pressure of the e-collar is and how to turn it off. So, <laughs> good girl. So we already know that Daisy's working level, which is the lowest level possible that she feels, is a three. So we're going to start at a three with Daisy. And all I'm going to do is condition her to the e-collar, um, where we're going to get her comfortable with coming back to me with the e-collar. So the way this is going to work, guys, all I'm going to be doing is I'm going to be touching the button, tapping the button, pop, 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 and adding a little bit of leash, leash pressure <clears throat> and guiding her towards me. As soon as she makes a step towards me, I release all the pressure, tell her good girl, and I reward with food. So I'm pairing her food with the collar. She turns the pressure off, she gets rewarded. So again, this is just conditioning her to the e-collar, teaching her what the pressure means and how to turn the pressure off. So all I'm going to do, I've got this set up here, we're on three. And all I'm going to do is start tapping, add a little bit of leash pressure, get her to come towards me. Then I will, as soon as she makes that step towards me, I stop adding pressure, I tell her good girl, and I reward with food. So, it should look like this. Good. Good girl. I'm not giving any commands right now. I'm not saying anything. I just want her to respond to the pressure and come towards me. Even if she's looking at me, that's okay. I can get her into a sit. And now I go again. Good. Good girl. And I par, par that with food. So she understands pressure, release, food. Good. Come towards me, she gets food. She's also turning off that pressure. Pressure motivates, release the pressure, educates. Good, good girl. Good job. I've done this a few times, so now I can start adding the command here or come to it, right? So, good. I did this a little earlier with her as well, so now I'm going to add the command now that I know she's responding to it. So this time I like to get her kind of off doing her own thing, get her to look away. Daisy here, good, good girl. So right there, now I'm adding that command. Now, so when I add the command, that is when I push the button. So I'm gonna say Daisy here. When I say here, I start tapping that button. As soon as she turns and comes towards me, pressure goes away and I reward with that verbal command of good and reward with food. The hard part is once they figure it out, they don't want to move away from me. So we add food, we throw food as well. Daisy here. Good. Good girl. Daisy here. Good. She's super food motivated and I just pulled her away from food, which was really awesome to see. Daisy. Daisy here, good, good girl. Daisy here, good. Daisy here, good, good girl. Daisy here, good. So she didn't come right away there, that's okay, she's learning. I just kept tapping that button, added some leash pressure to help guide her towards me.
Daisy here. Good. So I kept tapping, added a little bit of pre pressure. We're at three. I'm gonna go up to five, just to see if we get a little more response. She's really food motivated. Daisy here. Good. Nice job. Ooh. Daisy here. Good. Good job, girl. Good job. So there you guys go. A uh, little video on how to condition your dog to the e-collar. And also, that was a little bit of the starting process of recall, right? So, doing uh, some fun stuff with Daisy, and as you can see, she's not terrified of this e-collar. She's, you know, running to me happy. So, we're not shocking the dogs, guys. Um, we're just having fun and communicating on a very low-level pressure base. Good, good. Awesome, guys. Enjoy.